Two people are dead after a wrong way driver crashed into two vehicles Christmas night in the eastern part of the state. 22 News reporter Christina DeMores joins us live in studio. Christina, this is only adding to a growing list of wrong way crashes happening across the region. That's right, Heath. Just earlier this month, we reported on a deadly wrong way crash on I-395 in Webster. And I spoke with drivers who worry this will continue to be a growing trend. Imagine you're coming down the road and, and then you see somebody else coming towards you. What you do you do? What, to do? what do you do? What would you do if a car was in the wrong lane and heading towards you? Since 2020, there have been nearly 2,500 crashes here in Massachusetts in which a driver was in the wrong lane or going the wrong direction before a crash. And about 50 of those crashes were deadly. It's kind of scary. Like, I don't know if it's the lighting is an issue or oh, it's bad. And those deadly crashes continue to be seen here in the state. Earlier in December, two people were killed in a wrong way crash on I-395 in Worcester County. And just weeks later on Christmas Day, a man and a teenager were also killed after a wrong way driver crashed into two vehicles in Bristol County. According to police, the wrong way driver was a 41 year old man from New York who they believe was intoxicated when the incident happened. Alcohol impairment, older age and driving without a passenger increases the risk of being involved in a wrong way crash. That according to AAA crash data. Speeding is also a contributing factor in the majority of wrong way crashes. The state continues its pilot program to alert wrong way drivers with flashing lights and signs on highways in areas including Bernardston and Webster. But in the meantime, some drivers who are staying on high alert worry if it will be enough. The signs Very need to be good. more prominent that it's, you know, that you can see <clears throat> wrong way driving. According to AAA, the city of Springfield has the most wrong way crashes here in Massachusetts. Working for you tonight, Christina DeMores, 22 News.